A new senior center has been a topic of debate for several years in Needham. However, the main problem is location. The town's senior center exploratory committee recently held a public hearing to discuss possible sites the facility can be housed. Mark Mandel explains. Residents gathered on Tuesday night to voice their opinions on the possible locations for a new senior center. Five locations are currently being considered by the senior center exploratory committee. Ridge Hill, Greensfield, Rosemary Hill, the Emory Grover Building, and the Highland Avenue MBTA parking lot. These last two locations were the most recent additions to the list and drew the most reaction. I want to thank the town for making available the Emory Grove School. With all the talks that went on for months, maybe years, didn't even consider that because no one thought that it was available. It has become available. It seems to be a perfect choice. It's where the senior centers would like it to be. Emory Grover's location was both a positive and negative characteristic, as the majority of neighbors who attended thought that it would be too dangerous in combination with the St. Joseph School and the high school. We're very concerned about the congestion neighborhood and what safety would be for the school children in the area. Emory Grover were chosen as the site for the new senior center. And twice in the past year, one of my children has almost been hit by a car um, in front of my own house. And I think adding an additional 100 vehicles in that neighborhood where it's already extremely congested and we don't have the appropriate stop signs right now, I think it would be a real mm -hmm. tragedy. Furthermore, people wondered where the school administrative functions currently housed there would go. It will be also a fact that the SEC uh, keeps in mind when we make our recommendations, but we are aware that that's something that has to be done and there will be some cost implication to that, but before any final decision is made, uh, that recommendation will be made public and whatever cost is associated with that will also be made public. Reception was warmer for the MBTA lot, with neighbors welcoming the center with a few cautionary notes as well. I think it could be a good thing, and um, I just, I'm concerned about where the entrance and exits are. First, that intersection west and hillside, a very bad intersection, lots of collisions, so you definitely need to consult with the police department. Probably if you put in a light, would take care of it. Numerous if we were to totally bow to every traffic concern, we would never build anything in this country. Aside from commenting on the sites, some took the opportunity to express their frustration over how long this process is taking. I think that you should change the name of the committee to reflect that we are second-class citizens. There's pros and cons for every site. Uh, I don't have an answer, and I'm sure you don't have the best answer yet. Be nice to use We will in two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Amen. The deadline for a decision on the site was set so that a proposal could be drawn up in time for the November special town meeting. For the Needham Channel News, I'm Mark Mandel.